Hello and welcome to another edition of Beer Dads Beer Reviews with me, David Beer Dad, back again to do another beer review. Gonna do another Anarchy Brew, Anarchy Brew Company beer. And I'm gonna do Speed Demon. This is their unfiltered lager, it says there. Um, this is, I remember this one, it is about 5% says so there. Best before this one is May 20 next year. It cost £4.25. This will be that Dog Ogden got for me on his trip to Newcastle. Um, this is the last of those beers. Um, cheers, Dog. Next time you go up here, get me some more if you don't mind. Glad. I um, like this can art. Very, very nice. Basically, an alien or a screaming skull riding on a motorbike with the anarchy symbol. It looks a little bit like the alien from um, Mars Attacks. There you go, have a little look. Very nice, very nice indeed. Um, on this back we've got the malts, our Pilsner, um, Pale, uh, Rice and Maize. The Whirlpool Hops are um, Halato Blanc, Halato Melon, uh, I see it says Melba, it's a very small writing. And the dry hops are Melba and the yeast is W34 uh, dash slash 70. It says so there. Okay. So, unfiltered lager. This is brewed in collaboration also with uh, Ryan Roadkill. It says so there. So, let's pop a top. Let's see what we've got. A little bit less, we'll put that in shortly. So, being the last one we've got, well, it's, it's unfiltered, it's fairly clear, to be fair. Um, it's got a slight hazel, it's got a nice rolling carbonation right from the top of the bottom of the glass into the top of the two fit of the bottom of the two fingered, densely compact, soapy head. Unfiltered, that's pretty, looks pretty filtered to me. Okay, let's get a nose through as well. Smells like a lager, to be fair. Smells like a European, German, Czechoslovakian lager. That's what it smells like. Let's go for the, the carb and the body. The biggest carbonation. Not unpleasant. The body is light. A little bit watery. But certainly light bodied. Right. Get the rest of this in. So you don't swish and pour. See if this clouds up any. Nope. There you go. So it's just it's got a slight haze to it, but okay, fair enough. Right, let's go for a bit old taste. It tastes like a European German Czechoslovakian lager. It tastes exactly the way it smells. You know, <coughs> you know what you're gonna get. Um, rice there for a bit of an adjunct. Pretty flavourless, to be fair. Doesn't doesn't leave anything on the back end. A little bit of little touch dry, a little bit of spice, but not a no great shakes. It's all right if you like lager. This is not a bad craft lager, to be fair. If you make a transition from drinking, I don't know, start up an arm and uh, Heineken and Bex and all that type of cake, but you want to break into the crafty world, this might be a, a way forward, a way in. Um, it is a decent craft lager. 
it's just not my bag at all it isn't my bag it's for me there's not enough not enough taste to it but if you like lager then away you go so I can see it from both sides you know if you if you fed up drinking Heineken Star of Peran, San Miguel, Estrella, whatever, then this has got a bad little job, but no one's going to pay that for a lager, not really, not the can anyway, or the lager drinkers I know. Like I say, it's a decent craft lager, but it's not for me. So, uh, Anarchy Brew Company, Speed Demon, do I like it? It's okay. Would I recommend it to friends? <laughs> Excuse me, probably not. Um, and would I uh, buy it again? No, it's, not, it's just not my style. Um, if you've had this beer, let me know what you think. Put a little comment below. Uh, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Excuse me, if you like the video, give it a thumbs down. Subscribe down there, and I'll see you on the next one. Yeah, yeah.